Welcome to our YouTube channel. In this video, we will take you on a comprehensive journey to master pivot table. This is a powerful feature in spreadsheet software and we will learn how to analyze and summarize large data sets with ease, unlock valuable insights and make data driven decisions using pivot tables. Don't forget to subscribe now how and press the bell icon for more videos. Before start learning how we can make a pivot table, let's first learn that what are the pivot tables and how do they work. Pivot tables allow you to quickly and efficiently summarize and analyze large amount of data. They provide a flexible way to organize and present data in a meaningful way. You simply have to select your data set, choose the meaningful relevant fields and the pivot tables does the heavy lifting for you. It automatically aggregates groups and summarizes the data based on your criteria. So I would request you to please watch this video till end because I am going to teach you step by step process of creating a pivot table, customizing its layer as well as sorting and filtering options. First we will learn how to create pivot table on this simple example and later I will also share practical examples of its application on large data sets. This worksheet data shows names, item, rate, quantity and total sales amount. The first step is to click anywhere in this table and then we have to go to insert. Here we have to select pivot table. Then we have to select our table data. After selecting the table, we have two options. We can create the pivot table in the new worksheet or we can create it in the existing worksheet. So I'm going to create it in the new worksheet. I have to press OK and the pivot table is created for me. You can see that we have different options on our right and a table which is present in this worksheet. We will select the item and drag it in this filter. And here you can see that we got this different items over here. After creating the data, now we have to group and ungroup data in the pivot table that will allow us to consolidate information into meaningful categories. We will demonstrate how to group data by different categories. Like for example, if we want to show the quantity of sale. So when we select it from the right, you can see that the salesperson and the amount of the sale they have done is written in front of the name. Similarly, if we want to show it as per different category wise, like for example, if we want to have the data about the headphones, we will select this headphone and then press OK. So this time you can see that we have the information about the headphone sale from the different sales person and the sum of the total sales of the headphone. Similarly, we can select any of the different category and get data about the quantity of the sale. If we want to know the amount of the sale, we can select it from the right and now you can see that not only the quantity but we also see the sum of the amount that they have sold. In this way, we can select different categories and get the results of the various sales item. We can also get the data about the multiple items by selecting these multiple items and then check the two items or three at a time. Like if we want to get the data about the keyboard and laptop, we will check them and then press OK. Now we can see the data of both these items. Another thing that we can do is that in the ribbon section, we found these recommended pivot tables. So when we click it, we found the different tables recommended by the Excel. We can select it manually as per our requirement or we can select it from the recommended pivot tables that is given by the Excel. Another thing is that not only we can create the pivot table, but we can also generate a kind of report from it. We have to go to the analyze and then we can create the charts from this data. You can see that I can create a sales graph from this selected data, which is very helpful when we have to demonstrate or show it in our 
different presentations. Now I am going to share a real example. This is a big data of year-wise sale by a commercial store. From such data, numerous interpretation can be drawn based on our requirement. This is where pivot tables help you. I have created the pivot table with the method that I have already taught you. And you can see in the pivot table various items are now grouped up and I have the information about the year 2019 and 2020. And I can select different years from here and get the results based on different year or I can select different items and then get the information about those single items so from a single item to multiple items from a single year to multiple year I can generate various type of reports from that big data into a single table or a graph in conclusion mastering pivot tables open up a world of data analysis possibilities from organizing and summarizing data to uncovering insight and making information decision pivot tables are a must-have skill for any data enthusiast. With the knowledge and techniques covered in this video, you are well equipped to tackle real-world examples, challenges and take your data analysis to the next level. Start practicing, exploring and unleashing the power of pivot table in your work. Thank you for joining us and don't forget to subscribe for more valuable tutorials.